Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm Andrew Tolentino. I'm Dan Hitt. And uh, we're going to be uh, busting open a box of Panini's gridiron gear here. Uh, what's this retail at, Dan? Uh, it's about a hundred bucks, six bucks a pack, okay. um, SRP. Looks like we're going to grab around four hits. Uh, should, should be four hits out of this box. Yep. Four Oops. autographed and or mem cards in every box. Let's rip it open. And I predict that we get four. I, I think... What do you think? I think that sounds good. And I'm no Miss Check Cleo, this. but. Here you go. Thank you. Well, well I hope not. not. No. She got arrested, didn't she? I, I, years I did years not ago. know that. Is she, is she still. I thought she died. I wonder if she no, predicted I think she it. She died too, but. Oh, that's. <laughs> too soon. I think she might have been a fake, actually. I don't, I don't think she was really <laughs> a. A fake baby. psychic? Yeah, no. I think she was. She predict was, that she I'm was going to sure get arrested? I'm not sure about that. Yeah. These are good looking cards. I got to uh, take a look at uh, this uh, burlap card there. Got the logo on the name. Yeah. I got one of our hits right away. Bam. Go for it. Uh, quad rookie orientation with, um, it appears to be four wide receivers on it. Serial right. numbered uh, 150, including uh, your you friend there. of mine, Jordan Shipley. All right. And several other, Eric Decker and a couple other receivers. Not quite burnt on, but. No, nah, it's close. It's kind of Bengals orange, I think. Yeah, it's not think quite so. the right shade of orange. Look at a. Everybody's got like George Shipley. Yeah. Look at a couple, um, maybe 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 under noticed at this point. Uh, rookies. We got Blair Wyatt of the Colts and Sean Lee of the Cowboys, who are who are uh, you know looking looking like solid players. Well, one of the cool things about these, uh, we're starting to get into the later year products like this, mm -hmm. is in my pack I pulled a Kylan Williams um, rookie card. So you're getting um, a deeper roster of rookies in these products. You yeah. named a couple of guys. Sean Lee's been on this every product, and he's starting to, to come on. Yeah, but, well uh, right, but you're going to get the uh, breakout kind of rookies who weren't in the early year products. You're gonna get that in gridiron gear, which is pretty cool. Yeah. It's a good so the photography's that, really that's the first thing that jumped out at me. Photography on some of these yeah. is just awesome. It is great. And this is this is a look at a uh, you know a, a studio uh, photo of, of Gerald McCoy, which I believe uh, Panini's Tracy Hackler just did a, a video with him busting open some 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 packs, and this is actually this limited uh, 82 out of 100. And if you take another look at the, the front of this, it looks like, it almost looks like it's, uh, for, uh, at first when I looked at it, I thought I was missing an autograph there, because it looks like yeah. a, a slot for a... Insert an autograph yeah. there, yep, that's yeah, exactly, exactly right. Mm -hmm. Gerald McCoy's one of those highly touted uh, rookies who started out real slow, but the last few uh, weeks he's really coming on. Yeah. He is a... Uh, He's got a bright future, I think, sir. Like a lot of people predicted, he looks and pretty good now. This guy too. We'll see whether or not he has a has a bright future. You know, uh, after he does some recovering and Who do you got stays there? out of his turf toe. Job at best. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. The photography, uh, like as I said before, is really sharp and kind of cool, but it's enhanced in some sort of way. Yeah, uh, it, it looks a little darker, or maybe digitally sharpened. Maybe yeah, I'm not it sure. looks like I'm there's not a photography guy. There's, there's been some sort of contrast added to it. Oh. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Here's and our. Some of them almost look like paintings. Yeah. Here's here's another hit um, with uh, C J Spiller. This is an awesome looking card. Um, I'm gonna just play play puppet master here and pull this pull this in and out. Extend it all the way out. Don't want to wow. pull it out all the way. Oh, but it's got a. It locks. Uh, it, it locks in, so so you're safe there. It's numbered 33 out of out of 288, right? That's a lot of jersey pieces. Yeah, yeah. 228. 228. Is that so. CJ Spiller? Is that it what is. That's his CJ Spiller signing. Yeah. So a, I'm happy with that hit, definitely. Those are popular. Some guys don't like them, but uh, I'm not a big fan of them personally, but. Um, there's a, a following for those. I like the interaction. Show this yeah. Nate Burleson. You may not be able to see it on camera, but this is a good example of an enhanced kind of photo card that, um, again, it may not show up on camera, but it almost looks like a painting in some yeah. sort of way. It's in, yeah. it's, in, it's in color enhanced for sure, maybe sharpened. And 
I think did, it's called HDR, high dynamic range, but I'm not totally there sure. There you go, yeah. It's, it's kind of neat. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it does look good. That Burleson. Oh, yeah. I also pulled a, in that same pack, I pulled um, another line, uh, Calvin Johnson, a Game Breaker Prime Relic, serial number 50. Triple Swatch Prime Relic. It's a nice, nice watch on that one. So there's another one of our hits in the box. So not a hit, but this is a, it's a cool looking uh, uh, insert going on. It's a NFL Nation featuring Ladanian Tomlinson, the old LT there. This is number 24 out of 100. So take a look. Well, Andrew, I think I got the um, half of the box with all the hits in it. Yeah. I pulled a Kerry Meyer autograph, rookie Sweet. serial number to 99. Four there. All right. The surprising, surprising Falcons. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We got yeah. a Kerry Meyer hadn't done much, but look at that there. Moyaki, the Chiefs. A hot rookie. Yep. There's a lot of good rookie tight ends. Have you noticed yeah. that this year? I, I have. He's one of them. Maybe yeah. one of the best, if not the best. Yeah. Uh, for sure. And uh, his cards are starting to heat up as much as a tight end can heat up. Yeah. So he is doing it. Well, I give him an A plus on the base card design and, and the photography. I really yeah, like it. It's I, pretty cool. I think that, that it's a it's a good good solid start. For I haven't always been the biggest fan of gridiron gear, mainly because it's always been a good product and a solid product. But it, I think it kind of gets lost in the shuffle. It doesn't really have uh, other than the pull out autographs. Yeah. Um, of the rookies, it doesn't have um, kind of a unique uh, identity. Yeah. Not 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 a huge huge draw there, but but I, but, but I think having that said that the the base set and the photography that's in there, I think, is yeah. is a big uh, plus yeah. of this year's version for yeah. sure. And I think that this is actually this is a you know a, a, I don't know a respectable unique feature to, to to stick into a product, and I think it looks I think it looks great. But, yeah. So that's uh, that's Panini's gridiron gear. All right. See you next time. Adios.